Hi, this is Suzanne Perry, founder of LoveShouldn'tHurt.tv. October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and each day I've been here talking about different aspects and giving you some different information regarding domestic violence. Having an escape plan is crucial. Have your legal documentation in a secure place, preferably out of your house. So when you're ready to go, you have as little to worry about and bring with you as possible. Have things like your passport, your driver's license, your bank, banking information, spare keys, your birth certificate, and all that stuff for your kids too. You know, make copies, have it, even a safety deposit box at the bank. Have, store it somewhere off-site. So when you're ready to go, it's one less thing to worry about because your mind's going to be racing. That is the highest time that death occurs in a domestic relationship is when the person who's being victimized tries to leave because the abuser is threatened that they will lose control of their victim. It's so important that you have a good, well-planned escape plan. If you get a chance to practice it, practice it. Have an escape plan. Know what you're going to do where you're going to go, and who the trusting person is that you're going to notify. Not somebody who is on the abuser's family. Don't do that. Because no matter how much you trust them, they're on the other team. And your abuser will use that person to get to you if they know you trust them. Does that make sense? It could save your life. Thank you for watching. <laughs>